I've been told all my life, God loves me, but these same people told me I was going to burn. Religion accepts all of you except the terms and conditions, in fine print, heterosexual and cisgender for heaven admission. I believed you. I was made wrong, clearly, clearly, clear. You see through me, but you don't see me. You're surrounded by windows, but all I see are reflections. And me, shards and shatters, and me, again, shards and shatters, and me, again. I don't really like me. You wrote me down on a list of the wicked, my kind eternally banned from being saved because according to you, I should be in a grave, burning in hell for all of my days, dying over and over again because I'm an abomination. I've read your book. I studied the verses. For 19 years, I've carried these curses. God's word, it hurts, it burns. I'm worthless. I'm worthless. And you know what? I believed you. I believed you because I thought it would stop. Because when I look at my skin to within towards myself, I'm disappointed, angry, frustrated. It pains me. Why can't I just be normal? Why can't I just be fucking normal? Why can't I be what you want? What you made me want? You took a drill to my skull and made it known, a permanent hole, that people like me are something to be ashamed of. Oh. Oh no. And I believed you. You made me believe you. When you said that everything LGBTQ was not for me and you, it's deviancy from the L to the T, a storm of sinful sexual truancy, not for me, for I am unclean, dirty, I'm getting wordy, but I don't know how else to express that the hand of everything I detest slapped me hard across my face. There's a thing about hands, something my mom used to say, that if you're dreaming, your hands fade away, but I could see the hand clearly, clearly, clear, solid and clear. It was my hand, my arm, me. I was everything I hated. Why won't it stop? I spent years staring at a mirror. I didn't even know it. And I broke it over and over and disposed it. At some point, the glass cut and with one fist balled to shatter the last pane. I stopped. I see me staring back and, divorced from all your religiously driven fiction, I did not hate my reflection. A queer, trans, non-binary mess of a person. My mess, a beautiful, wonderful mess. Cat. And now the realization is here. It's queer, it's fear. It's knowing why 10-year-old me cried themselves to sleep every night and 15-year-old me shattered my psyche knowing something wasn't right. And the complex that complexed reflections in my inspections of my womanly body. God, he gave me such dysphoria that triggered out-of-body memories because the last body I wanted was female. For months, years, a lifetime. I'm not pretending, nor am I trending. I would not go through with being a disappointment to everyone in my life. I'm not a daughter, mother, sister, wife. I'd gladly take a knife to my breast and tell the rest to fuck off because there's no way in heaven I would bring hell upon myself for a little attention. Sometimes I wish no one would look at me. I don't want to look at me. I get hundreds of messages every week telling me the reason they came out was because of me. And they tell me I'm an inspiration. You made me who I am. Meanwhile, on the other end of the screen, I'm screaming. And every week I feel weak because your inspiring cat zoom is spiraling while I can't accept who I am. I put on a facade and I tell you I love my job. Meanwhile, people call me fat. Dyke, a disgrace to God, and I know if I throw in a hi, I'm transgender, that would only triple the offenders. But reading constant comments being accidentally misgendered, and hiding my body in three oversized sweaters, and not doing a thing about being non binary, lock it in a closet and toss the key in my pocket.
but I can't keep doing this. Their words can never hurt me. But I have a stick in my right hand and a stone in my left and a bruise on my thigh and a stake in my eye. My pen is mighty, my sword is dull, but my sword's inside me and my pen's been cold and I could stop the bleeding if I could just be bold. And say it. So, hi, I'm Cat. I know that's not my given name, but it's my real name. I love girls, non-binary people, and like, two men. And I am transgender, non-binary to be specific. Who are you?